Hello friends, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, we are going to learn solid layers in After Effects. Hello friends, in this video, we are going to learn about solids or solids layer. So this solids and solids layer are different. In this video, we are going to learn about this both and also differentiate what is solids and what is solids layer. So solids and solids layer are have too many advantages which we are going to learn in your upcoming videos. For now, I'm showing you how to create a solid layer. So solid for creating a solid layers, you have to go layer new and from here you can see solid. Okay. You can also create a solid by shortcut control plus Y. Fine. Just click here. And now here you have to select the name of this solid layer. You can also change the dimension. You can set your width and height. Also, you can change the color of this solid layer. So I'm just clicking this and uh, just make it make it a little bit of okay gold kind of solid just press okay okay as you can see I am changing my color and the name is automatically changed medium gray yellow solid one okay and press okay so guys as you can see I'm just expanding this so you can you will know the full name so this is our solid layer and as you can see after creating this solid layers automatically one folder is created over here which is called solids okay inside this solids okay there is a two solids black solid one and medium solid one this black solid one we already created in a one previous video that's why this black solid one is still here and right now we are creating a medium gray solid yellow one that's why this solid also done over here so now you can also change your solid name from here just press enter and you can set golden solid and press enter so this is our solid layer okay and this is our source solid layer so whatever name you are changing over here it will be not affecting in your project panel so guys as you can see this is our solid layer and this is our solids okay in this solids all the solids layer are added so the another way to create a solid layers by shortcuts control plus y or you can also right click on here go to new and create a solids okay i'm just cancelling right now now if you are duplicating the solid layers just press control plus d to duplicate it so as you can see the automatically these uh, solid layers are duplicate by the previous one now if you want to change this solid layer settings then go to layer and press solid settings okay and the shortcut for this is control plus shift plus y fine just click here and now as you can see you can change the name i'm just pressing golden layer 2 okay and i'm just changing the color by this okay and if you want the these <coughs> settings will apply to all the solids layer in this particular timeline panel then you can click this affect all layers that use in this solid so as you can see after clicking this just uh, check over here whenever I am switching off the golden solid will be golden if I am not uh, pressing this then it will be applied to all the solids layer so for now I am just press this off changing this to little bit of this color and press ok so as you can see both are different for now I'm just deleting this one now you can also use the solids layer for creating a different different backgrounds okay and for creating the backgrounds you can use your effects and presets in effect and presets many effect and presets need a solid layers for example you can see here deep tissue okay just double click on it or you can also drag and drop so as you can see on our golden solid this uh, deep tissue is applied this is a by default animation okay as you can see animation is already done in this solid layer you just have to play this timeline and as you can see your animation is done okay now you can also creating a mask using the solid layers how just click clicking on this solid layer and go to this I'm just uh, adding this rectangle over here or you can also creating a ellipse okay just pressing shift to creating a proper ellipse okay now I'm just selecting a mask and moving around this footage or you can say moving around the solid layers I'm just applying some feathers I'm just applying some feathers over here 
so okay okay so see the effect it's look good now so you can also applying the mask on the solid layer so there is a too many property in the mask just go one by one practice by yourself and you will learn a lot in this software so this is only about the increasing and decreasing the value and change what happen to changing the values so for now i'm just reading this solid layers and now i'm showing you how to create a background okay just uh, creating a new solid layer i am just adding uh, same as the previous one okay make as a comp size you can also change the size of this solid layer but you can if you want the solid layer same as your composition size then click on here if i am changing this just showing for the demo okay now my uh, solid layer size will be this but if i want to same as my composition size then just click on this make comp size so as you can see this will be changed see so now my solid layer uh, size will same as the composition size and press ok so in the presets and effects there are a lot of backgrounds over there by default backgrounds you just have to drag and drop and do some changes and you can create your own background or you can also doing by creating the mask okay in the preset there is a background okay there are a lot of background just uh, check one by one which one you like see there is a very cool effect you can just drag and drop and you can see the effect okay you can also change the uh, values from here to make it uh, whatever you like okay so just go through this all the backgrounds and change the values and see what is going to happen in the solid layers so what you have to do is just practice by yourself see the changes and applying your project uh, I'm the, applying the cylinders as you can see just deleting the previous one circuit oh wow very nice matrix kind of effect so there are a lot of background over here just go through one by one and you can cre also create your bunch of backgrounds for your projects so you no need to purchase your backgrounds from the websites or any paid website uh, just create your uh, background by yourself and enjoy it so guys this is all about the solid layers or solids in the upcoming videos we are going to learn about animation with keyframes Okay, thank you guys. See you in the next video. Thank you so much.